thousands of people were at Petco Park today for opening day. And after a win against the San Francisco Giants, the Friar faithful flocked to the bars and restaurants in the gas lamp quarter to celebrate. And that's where we find our Juliet Varro, who joins us with more on that. Juliet. Today was a huge win for businesses down here in the gas lamp. It was literally uh, bumper to bumper, so to speak, with crowds and uh, people. One business owner I spoke to said it had been several years since they'd seen so many people inside their bar and restaurant. The energy just felt different down here today, according to many San Diegans I spoke to. Go Padres! The sights and sounds of opening day fill the streets of downtown San Diego Thursday. <laughs> And it's music to Brie Lock Miller's ears. We needed this. Oh my, we've been counting down the weeks for opening weekend. Like, we are so happy it's finally here. As owner and general manager of Henry's Pub in the Gas Lamp, having crowds of people. Like, no tables available, so just stand at the bar. Is a huge victory. Between the Padres and the SUSU game playing, it feels like normal down, like pre-COVID downtown. San Diegans are feeling that same energy, too. Honestly, when I come down here, it's kind of like slow and everything. But when I come down here, and like it's packed because the fans are out here and everybody's out here. Oh man, it's a vibe. It reminded me of back in the day when when the San Diego nightlife was great. Along every street and on every corner, lines of people enjoying restaurants, bars, cafes. For us um, down here, it's something we've been waiting for all winter. Some business owners saying safety concerns and issues of cleanliness have impacted their bottom line. Some even cutting back hours. But to see these crowds gives them hope it'll be a winning season for everyone. We need our city to be on top sure that it's clean in a safe environment and with all of that things it circles around to people coming back down here again Woo! if downtown wants to survive we need people to come up for these padre games if these businesses want to survive we need people to show up so of course this is a good start tomorrow's game starts at 6 40 it's a friday night and business owners hope the momentum continues in downtown i'm juliette vara back to you